graph each function over the domain where theta is between 0 and 2 pi. The base graph is provided as a convenience. State the new domain and range. In part A, draw the graph of y equals 1 half secant theta. There is a vertical stretch by a scale factor of 1 half. Multiply all the y values by 1 half. The domain of the transformed graph is theta belongs to a set of real numbers, with the restriction that theta cannot equal pi over 2 plus or minus n pi, where n belongs to a set of whole numbers. The range is y is less than or equal to negative 1 half, or y is greater than or equal to 1 half. In part b, draw the graph of y equals secant 2 theta. There is a horizontal stretch by a scale factor of 1 half. Multiply all the x values by 1 half. The domain of the transformed graph is theta belongs to a set of real numbers, with the restriction that theta cannot equal pi over 4 plus or minus n pi over 2, where n belongs to a set of whole numbers. The range is y is less than or equal to negative 1, or y is greater than or equal to 1. In part c, draw the graph of y equals cosecant theta minus pi over 4. There is a phase shift of pi over 4 units right. Translate the graph pi over 4 units right. The domain of the transformed graph is theta belongs to a set of real numbers, with the restriction that theta cannot equal pi over 4 plus or minus n pi, where n belongs to a set of whole numbers. The range is y is less than or equal to negative 1, or y is greater than or equal to 1. In part d, draw the graph of y equals cotan 1 over 2 theta. There is a horizontal stretch by a scale factor of 2. Multiply all the x values by 2. The domain of the transformed graph is theta belongs to a set of real numbers, with the restriction that theta cannot equal plus or minus n 2 pi, where n belongs to the set of whole numbers. The range is y belongs to a set of real numbers.